When the sun goes down, Midtown Manhattan lights up, and one of the most famous blocks in all of New York City comes to life. The streets and sidewalks of Fifth Avenue are filled with a glow from street vendors, shimmering lights from the rooms at the Plaza Hotel, and a mesmerizing glimmer of the Apple logo that illuminates the staircase of the flagship store that sits just below the ground. But the store that Apple calls its worldwide flagship will soon be turning off its lights and closing its doors as an enormous remodel process is about to get underway. Apple Store employees have already begun to move contents from underneath the Fifth Avenue Cube over to the old FAO Schwartz Toy Store, which will be Apple's home on Fifth Avenue, at least temporarily, as construction begins on January 20th. Though Apple hasn't publicly announced what the renovation process exactly entails, reports among the tech community speculate that Apple will be taking direct design cues from its newly remodeled flagship store in San Francisco. The Fifth Avenue store is expected to get more open spaces for customers, an auditorium for classes and speakers, and a new Genius Grove, which replaces the old and kind of antiquated Genius Bar with new chairs where customers can talk to support technicians one-on-one -on -one in, in more of a casual environment. Apple hasn't given us an official timeline to how long the construction or remodel process should take, but visitors hoping to come to the Fifth Avenue Apple store should expect to visit the temporary one for at least a month or two. But until they close this one down, I'm going to take a look one last time just for memory's sake. Reporting from the Fifth Avenue Apple Store, I'm Robert Rosenfeld for Networking in New York.